close is this election shaping in your mind? Do you think the Premier will hold on? Look, I actually do think the Premier will hold on. Of course, it's too close to call, Kieran, as you guys have covered throughout um, this election. But it is one of the most interesting ones that I've seen since I started working in politics some 20 years ago. I think what we're almost seeing here is a number of by-elections. You know, obviously, we're all watching um, Townsville very closely in the three seats there, Barron River and Cairns. We're feeling increasingly confident in holding Keppel. But also, um, we think that the LNP will pick up Wood Sundays again. And Morani is also going to be a close call. So, look, I think we're in for a long night tonight, Kieran, and we'll be watching very closely um, across Queensland. Yeah. One of the complexities, of course, is the cohort that, like the borders shut, one that doesn't is the tourism industry. You're the outgoing minister. Uh, you mm -hmm. must concede that industry has been absolutely smashed by the COVID closures. Absolutely. Look, you know, I've been upfront and honest about this. Of course, this has been an extremely distressing and tough year for the tourism industry. And um, even when we are able to crisscross Australia again, of course, the international borders won't open. And that's really going to hurt in interesting seats that we're watching here tonight, Kieran, including the Sundays, the Gold Coast and also Cairns. So, you know, it's been an extremely tough year for that industry and I do expect that to play out. But as you say, um, I've been out there every single day on the polling booth with Jonty Bush and people that have come up to me and have not voted for me in the past and have been up front and saying, I've never voted Labor, but I will be voting mm. Labor this time to support Anastasia and her tough stance. That feeling and that sentiment that somehow Anastasia had been bullied um, by a number of, you know, from the Prime Minister down is actually real. The people say it to you and it's not Labor voters saying it. Kate, do you think the former Deputy Premier... Uh, will be defeated in South Brisbane? Look, I think it's going to be very tough for Jackie Trout to hold on. There is no doubt that she has worked extremely hard on the ground and has put up a really tough fight. I know what that feels like. But interestingly, I heard that your panel was talking about preference flows. What we've seen here is a very deliberate strategy by the LNP to run a spoiler campaign by preferencing for the very first time the Greens in a number of tightly held seats in the heart of Brisbane. So it's going to be interesting to see how that plays out. Not only in South Brisbane, but also, of course, in McConnell and indeed even in my own community.